Well, several organizations came together today to host an electric vehicle showcase at Somerset Community College North Laurel Campus in London. Many different makes and models were available for people in the community to check out. LEX 18's Rachel Richardson was there. London's Rotary Club and Evolve, Kentucky's electric vehicle advocacy group, came together to host the second EV ride drive event on Somerset Community College's North Laurel campus. Many came out to get their questions answered. Trying to figure out whether electric is a good thing to do or just another thing that we need to be thinking about. With conversations about energy alternatives on the rise, curiosity about EVs has gone up. Electric cars have been around for decades, but showcases like this one show how far the industry has come. Tesla, they got, you know, got the ball rolling and then uh, Chevy came out with their Chevy Volt and we've had uh, a couple of other uh, manufacturers come along and now we've got you know, uh, 15, 20 different manufacturers, 40 or 50 different types of electric vehicles. There was even a new pickup on the market on display here. Many people this rep spoke with were amazed by the EV's capabilities. Oh yeah, everyone is just like in amazement over it, um, about the like the range that it'll go, um, towing capacity, horsepower. I mean, it's, it's, it's crazy when you look at a vehicle and it's completely electric and this is what it can do. I'm here with Ellen Wade and she says whenever she's talking to someone about an EV, she wants them to consider the comfort, the convenience, and the safety. I've got an uh, electric outlet in my garage, similar to a dryer outlet, and every three or four days I just plug it in and I charge it back up. And if I have a long distance trip, there's so many chargers out there now, not just for Teslas, but for all vehicles. While electric vehicles are attracting more attention, there's still a question of cost. These advocates say that prices can vary and financial options like federal rebates can be available. Money can be saved on the back end with these cars requiring no gas and little maintenance, but what about up front? And, and they, you know, they start, you know, in the, in the low 20s and go, you know, astronomical. But uh, uh, so you can find something in your price range. The goal of today's event was to inform and let this community know what's available. Uh, obviously, we love to talk about these things, and uh, I think it's important to do so. This group is recharging their batteries, preparing for more shows like this around the bluegrass. In Laurel County, Rachel Richardson, LEX 18 News.